Okay guys, here we are with another dueling commentary against me hats rules uh, rule. I I don't get what exactly that means, but it's not for me to judge. <laughs> so Oh he's Canadian, I guess. Is that is that the Canadian leaf on his shirt? I don't know. Okay guys, we have an epic game of rock, paper, scissors. And I'm just picking random are you kidding me? I guess my random kept picking paper, so he chose scissors. <laughs> so, um, let me move my mouse and we will get onto this duel that we're about to get to. So, in the last duel, we got beat by a Chimera Tech Fortress Dragon, and in this duel, we're gonna try to win using Black Skulls or Black Meteor Dragons. What that is, is if you watch the anime, or the TV show, I guess. It is when Yugi fused Joey's black, or red eyes black dragon with his summon skull, and they made a black skull dragon. Or actually, I think that was Joey that did that. I could be wrong of who did that, but uh, it had 3,200 attack, and we're about to run to Blasphere, right? Oh, card done. Okay. Um, if you're curious what it looks like, here it is. Actually, that was played in the match against the Paradox Brothers. My bad. And in the match against Joey and Yugi. And here's the other one. So, um, I will be doing Deck Recipe after this duel. And the reason I chose a duel against this guy, or anyone in this thing, is because no one was really joining. So, I decided to do quick match and join them. Uh, okay, red eyes. Uh, I really want to make a dragon deck without this. If you guys are interested in that, go ahead and tell me in the section below. Because I would be interested in making one without a red eyes darkness metal. And see how well I can make it go. Also, I'm not afraid of back row. Um, there's a lot of chances he has a level 6. <laughs> Actually, no, I'm just going to end my turn. A lot of chances he has a level 6 in hand. Oh, he had Necro Garden too. He could have negated. That's cool, buddy. I have this. <laughs> Oh, get the dark bribe. Solemn. Nope. So, one thing to keep in mind if you start using stalling stuff like swords or whatever, your opponent will think, oh, you don't have anything really to help it out or something like that. Oh, you have like three cards you can activate now? Um, I want to attack his face down. Actually, I'll attack Trag. I don't know. Actually, Trag won't do anything. Let's make him waste that Necro. Hopefully. I don't care about... He's got a Morphing Jar. Yep. I didn't think about it until I attacked. So I don't have Avarice anymore. That's the only thing I cared about. I lost that. Uh, I'm sad of help. I hope I draw a heavy storm. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, and I lost swords too. So nope, I'm not even gonna play anything. I'm just gonna let him go straight on and attack me. It does 600, and I'll drop my try, and we'll have some fun. <laughs> I lost swords and pot of Avarice. That was probably my big losses there. Oh, that is not fun at all. What is that? Mask of Darkness. Okay. Uh, Swing of Memories just bring back Red Eyes or Black or Beast Skull Dragon. Oh, wait, does that technically work for... 
I don't. No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. Okay. Is there fusions? Uh, what is he trying to get? I don't get what the point of his monster reincarnation. Hmm. I wonder what he wants that for. Oh, look at this. So, I will have a total of 2,400. So, I am going to make a Beast Skull Dragon next turn. How, you may ask? Well, you have to stay tuned and find out. Well, actually, I don't know. I have to draw a Heavy Storm. Then I probably can do it. Heavy? Oh, this works. I guess. Um. Oh, he's playing a dark deck. Okay, straight up dark. But he's doing a horrible job about it with 60 cards. Um, this one? You gonna let me have that? You can negate it if you want. I really don't care. And, uh, how much attack does it have? 3,000. No, I don't care about changing my level. And then we'll summon this. Uh, no. Yeah, I wanted this effect. This one. Hopefully he doesn't have a level 8 in hand. Oh no, this is 9. There's no way he's taking that. Uh, and because I don't like back row, I'm not attacking. I don't care if you have back stuff you want me to attack. Oh, I should have attacked. I figured he's going to 3,600. Oops. Oh, silly me. Silly you, Drago. You could have done something important. Instead, you were worried about back row. And now he has 3,600 attack. Oh, okay. Um. Uh, um. I'll set this for good measure. I should have attacked. Sorry, guys. Um. Oh, he's trying to get Dark Creator back. Okay. Oh. He has a lot of cards in the back row. Hmm. Oh, there we go. That will do something. Put up the fence, yes. Acres attack, are you serious? Okay. Okay. It's 60 cards and get Acres attack. And since I hit the grave at the end phase, I don't get anything because I set. Dun 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 dun. Card of safety. Oh, he's playing a hack deck. Uh, if you guys are curious, that card is banned. So you know. He's gonna choose my black. Oh, nope. He wants a Veyu? Why? Okay. Um. Okay. You could have chose something way better than a Veyu, but okay. I guys, you had your reasons? I don't know, this guy is so confusing on his plays right now. I could have so attacked over this. If I draw a Heavy Storm, I'll be happy. Why did you choose a Veyu? There was really no point for choosing a Veyu. Okay, that doesn't hit anything in my hand. 
Okay, so you chose for Crush. Good job on wasting your Monster Reborn. Set this. Activate this. Set this. Set this. Okay, so we really wanted to crush card me. That was the whole point of that. Okay, fine on me, buddy. He knows I set morphing. I could have set this, but he knows I set the morphing jar. That would have been the obvious choice if I was if he was in my situation. CD Crow. Okay, you can banish my red eyes. I don't care. Go right ahead. I have like two more in the deck. Um, you know I'm gonna draw a heavy storm eventually. <laughs> Let's see, let's Trenchal, Dimensional, and that, okay. Oh, goodbye Summon Skull, hello Trapstun, hello Kapulse, that's good. Hello Samgen, and that's pretty much it. Bye, set. Bye Summon Skull. I can't use Heavy Storm now, but I don't already set it. Oh, goodbye, Red Eyes. Not that I really care. Um, it's another 400. Let's use a swing of memories and bring back summon. Uh, I'll take summon skull back and get over track go yeah. Oh crap, I just realized that. Oh, I just realized that why I can't get over it. I'm an idiot. <laughs> the bird and the mighty is on the field. Uh, I should have enough. No. Don't care. Um, crud. Oh, wait, no. He only went through a morphine jar already. Magic cylinder. Fine. I don't care. The less cards, the better. And we'll set both of those and we'll call it a turn. This guy's. I don't know, his playstyle. I, I guess. I see why. Because he has some great cards, but. I don't know. I think he really should cut it down by 20 cards. I know I ran a dark deck with 60, but I don't know. You don't really need all these in there. Oh, um, okay. Is he just trying to deck me out now? Because that's probably what I would do. use Heavy Storm, I'm gonna bounce your Trigodia back to your hand, buddy. Oh, you set the Monster Reincarnation. Okay. Uh, wait, what did you discard? Plague? Okay. Why would you add a Necro card in the back? <laughs> I 
I get that you want to put Plague in the grave, but why a Necrogardener? Okay. Fine of me. You just put back a Necrogardener to draw a Necrogardener. Uh, if you're curious, making a catastrophe wouldn't help arise that would, though. Yeah, that's gonna be game. Um, let's see. His deck is really kind of bad. I don't know what to say about it. It's like really kind of bad. Well, I guess for some more, like you, you really should. Okay. The thing is, this card should be going to the grave. What the heck's going on now? Okay, he's drawing a card. I guess. I don't get it. Oh, it's Sangin. Right, 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 right. Um... I know I keep saying your deck is bad, Mr. Roll, but... You know... Usually, in my opinion, and everyone's opinion, when you see a 60-card deck, it usually means that you're not really knowing what you're doing, or you're just... I don't know buddy I really couldn't tell you if I mean probably has great potential but 60 cards isn't really great so I'm not oh future fusion I don't know I mean I don't have room to be talking because I'm losing but you know said that I know I don't have the room to be talking and whatever, but I don't know, like, the only decks I really think are great that are at, that can go with 60 cards are Dragons and Light Sworn. I mean, dra Darks, I don't know, he's not really, he hasn't really done anything that looks like OTK potential. You banished a Gores? Okay. <laughs> um. Sure, we'll chain this for no reason. <laughs> this deck is very confusing. Oh yeah, the Lightning Vortex face down. Oh, I can't summon anything. There's no way you don't have a monster, by the way. You're serious. You have 60 cards, but you don't have a monster. You, sir. Um, I actually want this. <laughs> you just got rid of your lightning vortex, so I'm not worried about your stardust. He's probably just looking at me like, why is that in there? What? Wait, are you serious? You had that the whole time and you... Oh my gosh. Okay, you sir... I was just gonna say you're dead. Oh my gosh. Why? Why wouldn't you summon that? What would I have possibly faced down that you would have to worry about it? It was Stardust. Really? What? What, you thought I had Morphing Jar 2? Is that what you're worried about? Seriously? Oh my gosh. What? Okay. You're just... Wow, you're just on another level, guy. You, you just... 
its effect is negated and it is treated as a constraint. Treated as a. You just really. Uh, okay, dark arm. Fair enough. guy gives me a headache. Oh my <laughs> This brings like bad to a whole nother level. Are you serious? No, I'm not even gonna do anything. I can't do anything to be exact. I mean I could do this. And I can put you in defense mode. This is, this is not how you play Yu-Gi-Oh, buddy. You have three big monsters. Three. Each one of them could have easily attacked. You're doing, oh my gosh. You're doing all this for absolutely no reason. Uh. I love this shit, bro. That's the machine guy. So while he's being boring, I... Okay, go back to the game. Okay, so he made a thought roller attack with the thought roller. And now he's finally going to end this, right? Okay, there's a problem with this though. If you go to him after you lose, and you try telling him, Okay, you should really lower your deck. They're just going to get mad at you. So, they're just going to say, you're a noob, and blah blah blah. So, this is how you say this if you want to be nice. Well, I'm not going to say lower your card. Good game, man. I had fun, but there was some really questionable things when it came to your place. But good game. Now, if he's a good sport, he'll say, yeah, good game, and whatever. But he might not even write me back, because he's like, oh, that guy sucks. He doesn't deserve my opinions about people. So, my thoughts about that. Duel. Um, he... He won, yes, but uh, uh, so, so, uh, it's just because <laughs> he could have won so many times, and I don't get what was the point. You didn't even do anything that was special. I get, I lost. I'm probably be like, oh, rage quit mode. <laughs> but you know, if you if you were him, you would have attacked. There's nothing that you could have feared. If you knew dragons and you were banishing my red eyes, which I would have done too, you were very aware of how they play. But I wasn't running dragons, I was running red eyes, but that's a different point. You could have easily, easily have token me out there. Even if that was Exploder, even if that was Mass Dragon, it. When you guys, okay guys, here's a tip, don't play 60 card decks, because, I don't know, you didn't really do anything special with it, so if you guys say, oh I have all these extra cards I can help out, if you're not going to do anything special for your deck, don't really play them, don't have 60 cards if they're not doing anything for you. And, if you can attack and win, Honestly, you have a Stardust and you have a Gale. If you can attack and win, win. Gores can't come out if your opponent hits zero life points. So that was enough ranting about that. 
I really did enjoy the duel, and I still wish he would lower his attack size. Uh, did he say anything? No? Okay, good. Um, yeah, I'll catch you guys later then. Uh, good game, Mr. Whatever Rule. Uh, tips, lower your deck down, and don't be afraid to attack if you know you have game. Because Gores can't be summoned when they have zero life points and Battle Fader is not in this game at all. Or Swift Scarecrow, or anything like that. Okay, enough ranting. Good game.